Alex Blackwell has reached the very top in sport as vice captain of Australia's women's cricket team. But she's had some low times too since she came out publicly as a gay woman. I was made to feel at a cricket event that perhaps the sport would be better off without someone like me. Australia has the highest participation rate of gay men and women in sport, but a global study shows it's among the countries with the highest prevalence of homophobia against players. Gay men especially, but also women, are victims of bullying, verbal abuse, even physical assaults across most sports. 80% of respondents said they had witnessed or experienced homophobia in sport, and that's huge. Fear of abuse has forced many kids out of sport altogether and kept others, like Olympic swimmer Daniel Kowalski, in the closet till they retired. Now out and proud, he and Alex Blackwell are among several elite athletes on the lead float in this weekend's Mardi Gras parade with an anti-homophobia message. Hopefully if it, you know, if it assists one or two boys and girls to, to come out and be understanding and accept that you can be a great athlete and gay, that will, and we've actually kicked a goal. <laughs> and we know gay kids commit suicide more than their straight counterparts, so we need to do it also to save lives. Australia's pro-gay rugby club, the Convicts, are still putting the finishing touches to their float, a human version of their Premiership Cup. You'll see the Bingham Cup actually recreated out of human flesh. The gay athletes will be among 10,000 participants in this year's Mardi Gras parade. Anne Barker, ABC News, Sydney.